This is a 2006 Mini Cooper S convertible. It's done in a nice medium gray metallic with the black ground effects. As we look at the engine compartment, the engine compartment looks excellent. Engine runs nice. According to the Carfax, this uh, Mini Cooper does have a clean Carfax on it as well. It's been very well taken care of. It's got, uh, I'll have to check, but I think just over 125, 126,000 uh, miles on it. It's got the nice cloth black convertible top, and that's all power. It's got the black racing stripes on the hood. Tires are in excellent shape on it. It's got a nice set of wheels on it. As far as our tires are 205, 45, 17s. As far as the paint and body, the paint and body looks great. Um, it's got a few little chips and stuff here and there. We got just a little bit of a scratch right here in that front nose. Um, and there's some little chips. You can see there's a shadow out of the way. There's a tiny little paint chip here, and there's there's some of those um, around on the car. But as far as the majority and stuff of the paints, in really nice shape. We do have a little tiny chip right here, kind of a little chip ding. No rust anywhere in the lower doors. All that looks excellent. The doors and the uh, quarter panels. There's no dings anywhere here that I can see, besides that one I pointed out on the passenger side. Dual exhaust tips coming out the back. As we look around the back here, we do have a couple scratches here in this back bumper right here. And a little ding right there by my finger. Other than that, the uh, tailgate area is in excellent shape. Tail lights are nice. Um, cloth convertible top, even though it's 2006, it's in excellent shape. Very nice. It's got power windows. Paint in the door jams is all original as well. Beautiful shape. Very nice. Like I said, it's a kind of a charcoal metallic. Really nice paint color. As far as your interior goes, there's a little wear over in the driver's side. It's 12 years old, so there's just a little wear over in that driver's side. I'll point out a little closer. Passenger side is seat is in excellent shape. Slides up the carpet and it's got the factory rubber mats. Carpet's excellent shape. Um, back seat's nice. It does have a little split, like a little tear or something or an imperfection way over on the passenger side bottom. Other than that, the door panel's in the back. Back seat's good. It's got the front floor mats. got the cup holder, uh, factory CD player. So that's in good shape. As far as the, uh, um, does have a six speed manual transmission. As we go around here to the driver's side, driver's side rear quarter is excellent, just like the other side. There's no imperfections I see there. One tiny little door ding right here. Very small, about the size of the edge of my finger there. So we go in here, the corner of the door is absolutely perfect. Uh, no rust anywhere on it. I got this car out of Missouri. Very solid car. Door panel's in great shape. Um, as far as the dash and stuff goes, the paint on the dash is just as nice as the paint on the outside of the car. It's in beautiful shape. Um, CD player works, heater works great, air conditioning, it's got the horn, cruise, all that stuff on the steering wheel. 
tachometer works, brake light works, outside temperature light works. It's 30 degrees today. Brakes work perfect. Car shifts great, first, second, third. Tons of power. I'll go ahead and roll up her windows now. There we go. It's kind of weird, the power top switch and the power window switch is all up top. Just gets you used it takes a while to get used to where all the switches and stuff are on it. As far as our front suspension, the car uh, runs and drives great down the road. Absolutely no pull left or right on the braking. Um, as far as our steering goes, it goes down the road nice and straight. Really fun little convertible. And like I said, six-speed transmission, so this thing will get great gas mileage. It's got a lot of power, not much weight. These are pretty cool. You got the big speedometer. It's got 126,759 miles on it. Gas gauge works, temp gauge works. Everything seems to work well on it. high-speed braking, no pull left or right. 